Hi everyone. So math today is just a review of topic 13 because we are done with it. All right. So what you're going to do is you're just going to review everything that you would have learned in the last seven days about how to sort by attributes, how to make groups of things by attributes, how to count the number of things in a group, and how to create either a real graph or a picture graph that matches. All right. So let's look at set A. And remember the reteaching one gives you a lot of examples, so I won't be doing any today. All right, right here in set A, you're going to look at this, and you're going to see two things that are the same. They have the same attributes. They're both circles, and they're both red. And then you look over here, they've circled the other red circle as the, map, the one that matches this group. For number one, what you're going to do is you're going to look at these two shapes and decide which one of these matches and belongs in this group. All right, for set B, what you do is you look at a series of different shapes and you decide which one does not belong, which one is different from the others. Same on this side, different on this side. So they have done this for you. This one is different. And can you tell how it's different? Yeah, it's a different shape. It's not a different color or anything or a different size. It's a different shape. This is a circle and these are all squares. So the X, you can trace the X and do that. Now you're going to look at this set and decide which one is different. For the back and set C, there's a group of shapes right here. And you're going to sort the shapes in two different ways. Okay, so it took this groups of shapes and it sorted them first right in this first box by shape you got it so the triangles are over here and the square is over here and the second box is sorted them by color exactly all the red are here and the yellow ones here now you have to take these three shapes right here and sort them in two different ways so that means you'll have to draw them so you could put some over here and some over here and then some over here and some over here same set sorted two different ways all right folks and then set d finally is you're supposed to tell how the items are sorted and draw another object that belongs in the group. So look at all the objects and decide how are these objects the same. They're all red, very good. And so the person that did this already for you has drawn a red heart because it belongs in the red group. Very good. Now you're gonna look down here and look at all these objects on the tray and then the objects outside and decide how are these objects on the tray sorted from the objects at the bottom and then add another object that matches the same sorting that was done. All right, folks, there is no video for this one. I should mention that first, but I forgot. Um, this is just reteaching. Tomorrow we're going to dive into shapes. I recommend, since this is a very short math lesson, that you go on happy numbers and work there. Um, seven or eight of you have done excellent work and have made a lot of progress. I'd like to see everyone else on there now. All right, bye.